Greetings everybody, I'm back here with Super Metroid and holy shit the last episode ended with this lava racing and we need to run the fuck out of here! And that's it. A big lipped alligator moment. We took their treasure, the speed booster, and now we are invisible. Oh shit, they killed themselves. Even though I wasn't there. They just felt the presence of me and then they decided to kill themselves. Now, there is something to the left there, but it's very hard to get without, you know, the grapple beam. So I'm gonna leave that for now. Oh shit, magma balls with skull faces! These guys, but on the ground. Now they do take damage from the normal shots, but they didn't do that before. What can be in here? A secret! But, to no avail, it's one of those secrets that doesn't lead anywhere, because it is a way out. I like that those statues, you know, crumbles when you touch them. See, up here, we can't do anything. And that would be a very big secret break if you could go in that way. See, almost every room has some way you can sequence break. I don't know, I may say that word a little bit too much in the series, so I apologize for that. No! Oh shit, his, his shot actually saved me! Wow. Close the door behind you. <laughs> Missile! And once again, here is a place. We need to grapple me, but I'm just gonna do this. And I'm over. So fast and easy. Breaking the law, yeah! And another room like this, where we find the W. It's the wave beam! Yes, another upgrade to the beam, which we get in advance. The wave beam is very cool. It make, makes a cool sound. And it goes through walls and objects. You know what that means? It actually- wait, I can't go up this way. Fuck, I'm stuck! Okay, good. Now there's a way you can go up here instead. It's like, what? You're just teasing me! What's the point? What are these things? And this session is uh, considerably longer than the last one. That's because I had the- you know, I had a stream in like one hour, so... I need to prepare and eat, and then my power went out. Oh shit. I thought there was going to be two of them, but never mind. Oh shit, they're doing this backwards. That's so weird. Normally I would just, you know, go where I need to go and skip this area because it's just a progress area, kind of. But it's uh, quite cool. You see, this guy, he. Shit. He doesn't fall down, but the other one did. This is the only strong McFalcon. Okay, we need to hurry up in this place, because normally you would go... Oh shit! I guess I fucked up! Wait, can we... Oh shit! Okay, I think we can do this. Oh my god! I'm not supposed to be here! Normally you would go from this direction and the lava will rise, but now the lava was already rise because I'm on the other side. So we had to sacrifice an energy tank there. Good. I thought I was going to die first. This place, eh, no real point. I might as well just blow it up. We'll go here later. Later. And you see, these doors. Fuck him. But the wave beam says fuck you. And we can pass. But I'm not gonna do that right now. Oh shit, look at these guys. They're so cute. They spit lava at you. And depending on your height, they will go up to that height. And you can shoot their flames for some ammunition. He's so cute, look at him. Elf. Oh shit. This is what I call a supply room. It's uh, like the one over at the speed boosters. 
as a group of firebirds, get some stuff back. Nothing else. Whoa, that took off like a rocket. And now we are back at uh, this place. Now, there's a shortcut right here. You can uh, blow up these right here with a power bomb. But now let us progress to. Let's see. Wow. Um, I'm going to take uh, the normal way this time. <laughs> Need to go back to the elevator. The North Fair is the um, first place we're gonna spend quite some time in. Let's see what's down here first. A group of fives again. One of that, those guys. And see, you need the wave beam to go in here. But you're not supposed to have the wave beam before the grapple beam, so let's see. This room, it's just a full on speed. Woo! So, ex so satisfying, I mean. Save points. Good stuff. Now we're back at the main place. And we're gonna go back to that room which I said, Oh shit, I can't do the speed ball. But now I have the speed booster so I can just run past it. Just like this. Woo! Use the power bomb down there. I think you can blow up this. Never mind. <laughs> I like that he's upside down even though he's close to the ground. Oh shit, look at this. Oh shit. Okay, so the normal route is this way, but I do this instead. <laughs> I feel like a dick. I feel like one of those, oh, I'm so fucking good. <laughs> Take that way. Go in here. And we got the ice beam! Yes, we have three beams upgrades this session. Oh wait, we got the charge beam as well, but we have the ice beam now. Yes, it's ice. I wonder what it does. Now, both the wave beam and the ice beam increases the damage. But in a weird way, the ice beam makes so one-hit enemies will not die in one hit. and will still die in you know, two hits, because you need to freeze them first. But uh, overall, the ice beam is so much nicer. Just freeze everything. And with the wave beam, you can free freeze enemies through walls and open doors through walls and all that. Now with the ice beam, this is the trial. Just like that, and that guy as well. Now this room, I have a challenge. Try to survive as long as possible without falling down. You need to jump like almost frame perfect or else you fall down it's very hard okay, can we go down here yes we can awesome then we can just go straight down here this place has so many enemies so yes like to run right into it drop a power bomb and watch all of them die so much easier oh you survived i'm gonna let you survive just because of that Okay, this room we need to be a little careful in. You see, you fall down from this thing. Now, there is something very precious on that side. Just gonna try to jump on that, this guy. And then... No! No! Fuck! Normally you can jump on these guys, but fuck, I guess I messed up. Damn it. Or you can do the frame perfect jumps. Which is not very easy, but I guess I just got it. Okay, jump. Yes, I got the missile. One of the irritating missiles to get. I remember I, I had a lot of problems with this one. I never figured out that you could use these guys as a platform. I don't know why, I just killed them. Now we got that. This room is run and gun. Oh yeah! Woohoo! Now ain't that extremely fun. You can actually go back. You see, you normally just run through this place and you don't take a look at the scenery. Oh, shit. Ah, look at the map. 
This looks so weird. This one right here. I'm down, way down here. And uh, down here, we don't want to go right now. Oh, look at these guys. Spiky Wikis. Look how fat he is. He's so cute. Let's see, we're gonna go up here. Yeah, later. So let's go in here first. Save and end this part. Yes, thank you all very much for watching this part. And I will see you in the next one. Man, we're progressing so much in this, com this series so far. So, yeah. Take care, good folks. And I will see you next time.